Colin, the Pelicans up to number 14. We talk about the Cavs stumbling after the break, but CJ McCollum and the Pelicans are on the rise here. Yeah, McCollum has looked absolutely great. He looks like a game changer for them. You know, the Pelicans got off to just a god-awful start to this season. They've actually played pretty well since then. And obviously, since they've gotten McCollum, uh, they've gotten a lot better. They've played eight games with him, and in that span, they're second in offense in the entire league and ninth in defense. Look, that's exactly where you want to be as a team, right? And, and part of that is matchups and who they played. But it's clear that McCollum was that, that extra perimeter scorer that they needed to take some pressure off of Brandon Ingram, who's become a much better playmaker this season. Uh, kind of gone under the radar with all the Zion Williamson stuff. Uh, the, the latest updates on Zion is that, you know, his foot is healing, but he's still not putting full weight on it. So the odds of him coming back towards the end of this regular season or for a potential playing game seem pretty slim. Uh, that being said, I think the Pelicans are looking to finish this season strong rather than go in the tank. Uh, you look at a team like the Phoenix Suns, who went into the bubble as a fringe playoff team, went 8-0, carried that momentum into the following season. I think that's what the Pelicans are looking for here to end the season uh, with McCollum and Ingram and Jonas Valanciunas building on that group, uh, trying to get their young players on board. I think Willie Green deserves a lot of credit for what he's done there, particularly after that rough start to get this group playing this well. So I'm looking forward to seeing what they look like as the season finishes. And obviously, if and when they get Zion Williamson back at full strength, this could be a real dangerous team in the Western Conference. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.